Move over, Jack LaLanne. There is another fitness guru pushing 90. And while she may not be the master of the jumping jack, she does a mean downward dog. My name is Tao Poshon Lynch. I'm 87 and will be 88 in August. And I'm a yoga teacher. 87 is an age that many of us may never live to see. I'm up every morning at 5 o'clock. And, um, and I usually go to bed around quarter to 12, 12 o'clock midnight. A stage of life for those who reach it, known more for its limitations than its possibilities. I do yoga even before I go to bed, and I do yoga with my students when I get up in the morning. But then there are the exceptions, the inspirations, and Tao Porshawn Lynch is one of them. She has been a yoga instructor for almost 40 years. My students are wonderful. The greatest thrill that you can really have is to see someone who says, I can't do it, and show them they can. Tao, who grew up in India and France, is a living, breathing example of what can be done. Watching her, it's hard to believe that she had a total hip replacement three years ago. And at the time, doctors said her flexibility would never be the same. It's just a matter of putting your mind on it and you can do it. I'm very stubborn about everything. When people say it can't be done, I have to do it. When she is not doing yoga or leading a trip to India, Tao can be found here on the dance floor. I love to, to waltz, but I love to jitterbug. I like to do samba. I like to do cha-cha-cha. Um, I like to do foxtrot and um, all the crazy ones. And above all, I also like to tango. Sort of livens up your spirit. It's almost like drinking champagne. It's true. Tao's life has been filled with glamour and excitement. As a professional model and actress, she moved to the United States in her early 30s. No doubt she owes a great deal to good genes and good fortune, but she's also been blessed with an irrepressible spirit that keeps her going strong. There's so much to learn, and I just feel I don't have enough time to learn everything. There's so many beautiful places to go to, and and people to meet, um, and, uh, you, and this is why I say you have to live right now. You have to go and do it right now. See something that's beautiful. See something that makes you smile. If you can smile at everyone, you'd be surprised how it opens the doors to all sorts of great adventure, and this is what's important.